Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so I'm going to do something a little bit different in today's video. You can see that I have a pin out. Um, so I've been doing a lot of digging around on YouTube and trying to see, you know, what I like to do. Um, what is, you know, something that interests me, you know, stuff like that. And I've always been into journaling, obviously, you guys know that. I've always been into creating journals, making journals, uh, writing in journals, it doesn't matter. Um, I also enjoy record keeping, memory keeping, scrapbooks, stuff like that. Um, but I also enjoy positive thinking, and I very much um, believe in the power of positive thinking. So. I decided that I was going to combine two aspects of my life that I very much enjoy into one aspect. So I decided to do a December daily. Uh, we're going to go over it once a week. I think we're going to pick Fridays to do the December daily. And I will just show you kind of what I've been doing throughout the week. Uh, today is Tuesday, so it is actually December 1st, so we're going to be doing the first day together, and then next Friday on the 11th, we'll sh I'll show you what we did, f or what I did from the 4th, which is when you're seeing this, until the 11th. So you'll get a full week of what I'm doing, and I'll probably save a day, so... Um, that way I will have something to do with you guys, if that makes sense. So I went ahead and I made a journal. Um, so I'm going to flip through this really super quick. It's nothing, you know, extravagant. It's just a simple one signet or actually no, I lied. It has two signatures in it, um, but they are fairly small because the purpose was to be a December daily. So I wanted this theme to be Santa Claus because to me, Santa Claus represents magic, and magic is very powerful in my life. I don't necessarily believe that, you know, hocus pocus magic or anything like that, but I believe that there are a lot of things that are unexplainable, and to me, that is magic. Um, the power of positive thinking is also very magical. Um, so I did some stickles here on the Happy Christmas and the flowers down here. I don't know if you'll be able to pick that up. Uh, probably not. Yeah, nope, nope, okay. So anyway, uh, there's a Santa Claus, there's a Santa Claus, um, there's another Santa Claus, and a different Santa Claus, and then this one here. This one is definitely my favorite, um, and this would have been the cover had I not already folded the journal this way, um, because I couldn't fold it back the other direction. But this is probably my favorite. It's um, a, a Northern Europe is kind of where he comes from and I really like him a lot. So what I'm going to do with the journals is um, first I'm going to go through and flip through and show you guys. So it's 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 blank. There's nothing here. It's just a bunch of numbers. Um, this one I did put a background on because the numbers red, the background paper is red. Um, I didn't do any kind of planning so I had to accommodate on a couple of them. There's that one and then there's this one here. I do accommodate this one because, well, green background, green number. You kind of get the picture there. And then also, too, I didn't think to give the 25th its own spread, its own layout. Um, and in hindsight, I would have been able to do that because I have enough pages left over. But I did give the, the 30th uh, yeah, the 29th, the 30th, and the 31st, their own pages, their own full spreads, because I don't know how to math, and I ended up with a few extra pages. And so we can just do something at the end that's special. So my idea for this was to kind of combine my love for inspiration and positive thinking with the December Daily. And so I have a book here that I write down um, I just want to make sure that was closed so I didn't write all over my journal. So I have another journal. <laughs> I have a couple. So I have another journal over here that I write down all kinds of different things. This is my catch-all journal. It sits on my desk and I just kind of, if I think of something, I write it down. 
Um, so this was something that you guys haven't seen yet. So let's just ignore that. Um, this is some ideas for some videos and we're just going to ignore that. And then I did some quotes over here. Okay. So, um, there was, uh, there was one that I really, really liked a lot. Um, actually there's several that I like a lot. Um, but I think I'm going to go with the magic because the whole reason I picked Santa Claus was because of the magical inspiration behind it. So I think I'm going to go with this particular uh, quote and it is, um, let's see. Oh gosh, I don't know how to say his name. It's Johann Wolfgang von Goff, I think. Goff, Goff. But it is Johann Wolfgang. Um, but I don't know. It's G-O-E-T-H-E. -E. That is the person who wrote this. So if you guys have inspirational quotes that you would like me to use in my December daily, then by all means, send them to me. But I have to have um, the source of the quote. Um, so I can't just like write something down. I have to have the source. But if you have your favorite quote and you know who wrote it, you know what the source is, shoot me an email. My email's in the description box below and make sure that you title the email inspirational quote. Um, so I'm going to go with this one. It says, um, magic is believing in yourself. If you can make that happen, you can make anything happen. So I'm going to write that down here. Um, Magic is believing in yourself. That's the first part. If you can make that happen, you can make anything happen. And we are going to do this um, once a week. It's going to be Friday. And I'm going, my watch is beeping. Um, I'm going to read you guys the quotes that I have chosen for each day because I'm not going to necessarily be doing this every single day because I have plans for the rest of the week, if that makes sense. So let me write down the source real quick because I don't want to forget that. It is Johan. I'm probably not saying his name right. And it is Wolfgang von Joe Goff, I think is how you pronounce that. I'm not sure. Um, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to decorate the page a little bit. Now I don't want too much on this page because I do want to make sure that this is highlighted and um, we can even go as far as to actually highlight it. Um, there's a marker here. Um, I've got a gel pen here. I got a little teal pen here. Uh, those are inks. I don't want that. Um, there's probably a blue marker. Yeah, a blue marker over here. I have all kinds of markers up here next to probably very loud right here. Um, so I think this one's a dry erase marker actually. So we're going to go with magic first because I love the magic part. So magic and go with believing. anything okay so we're just highlighting a couple things um, and I'm literally using highlighter right now I'm just using the this part over here instead of like the whole thing I'm just 
going back over um, the letters that I wrote. That's it. Nothing great or grand or anything like that. I'm going to highlight his name here. Or not, because this pen doesn't work. All right. Um, we're gonna highlight make. Okay. So it doesn't have to be anything great or grand or extravagant or anything like that. Like I just highlighted a couple different words within this particular quote that I really think are important. And now I'm just gonna grab. I have a couple things that I've cut out. Just a couple. Um, we did this the other day. Actually, um, yesterday, Thursday was when we did this. Dear Santa, that is a really cute one. I want to put that. Um, I definitely want to put this somewhere in here because it's Santa Claus. Um, but I think this one's very fitting. It says believe. Um, I want to highlight this a little bit. So I think what I'm going to do with this one is I'm going to ink around the edges to kind of highlight this and make sure it pops up from the rest of the page. And you can definitely use like stickers, um, washi tape. I don't happen to have any Christmas washi tape sitting right beside me. Um, I do have some, but I don't have any sitting right beside me. Now this is a very dark color, but that's kind of the idea. I wanted to go with the darker one. I do have a lighter one. The lighter one that I have is, what are you called? Uh, uh, you're called not right in front of me is what you're called. Oh yeah, you are. Uh, this one's called coffee. So I do have a lighter one. I just, I actually really like the darker one. I don't know why. I guess because it just makes it pop a little bit more. I guess. I don't know. So I'm going to use Fabri-Tac here because I don't want it to warp the page at all. And you can use whatever your favorite glue is. But yeah, so I would really love it if you guys send me what your favorite inspirational quote is. Um, and if you want me to feature that, then... Yeah, just make sure you send me the quote as well as the source. The source is important. My phone is not making any noise, but, um, oh, it is making noise. Uh, my speakers kept going off. You know how like your phone um, will uh, interfere with your speakers on your computer if it like catches something like a, um, a text message or something? I didn't hear the text message, but it sure enough was there. So there's that. It's the most wonderful time of the year. That's too big. Cause I want to, I want to still see Santa over here. Holy night, peace, season's best. Oh, aren't you cute? Yeah, you're, you're super cute. I don't want to cover anything up down here. So I think we're going to put this right up here, but I'm going to highlight you too. And that's kind of why I left it blank because I wanted to be able to decorate it. Whether it was, you know, right then and there, or whether it was with you guys or, you know, whatever the case may be. And we might actually have another, um, another time or enough time rather to do another quote and we can do tomorrow's quote together. Um, of course, tomorrow's quote for me is going to be the second because I did want to start this on the first. Um, but I had already scheduled videos out, so I wasn't going to be able to air this until you guys see it now, which is Friday. I know it sounds super weird, because I'm like talking about like the past. Um, oh, today's Tuesday, not Monday. Did I just say it was Monday? No, today's the first, it's Tuesday. So anyway, 
I know that probably sounds super weird. Okay, I really like that. Isn't that cute? Okay, I also got some magazines because I plan on having some cutting sessions with these magazines. Oh, they are so pretty and so fun. We're gonna, I am making a Christmas glue book. Are you ready for that? Oh my God, I've never made a glue book before, but I'm really excited. Okay, um, this one's really cute. You miss 100% of the shots that you don't take. And that is by Wayne Gretzky. See, I like that one too. Um, I want to see if I can't find one that's kind of short. That one's, that one's pretty short. Um, some of these are decently long. Oh, this one's nice. Uh, this source is unknown, but it says one day or day one. You decide. That is such a powerful message. And it's just so simple of a message, you know? So let's write that one down. I like that one a lot. So it says one day or day one. You decide. Oh my gosh, I love that. All right, let's find my friends because yes. All right. All right, so one And day. Uh, and put a big O or there we go. And then you decide. Oop, that's backwards. You the side. That is so powerful. Source unknown. And I'm just putting quotations around it. Okay. Source unknown. And oops. Don't mind me. I'm just beating up my mouse over here. I'm going to write that down real quick. All right. All right. That's it. So we're going to close this up. Set that over there. Still like that dear Santa. That's not going to go right here because I already got the Santa. But so what can we do with that? Christmas, season green. These are huge. I have no idea what I'm going to do with those yet. And I don't know what that noise was, but that was a very loud truck or something. Happy holidays. Jolly. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Sorry. All right. Postcard greetings from the North Pole. Isn't that cute? Another believe. Holy night. There's a present. Check the halls. What are you? Merry Christmas. Oh my gosh. If my husband walks through the door, my dog is going to go crazy. I don't know why, but she goes absolutely bonkers when he walks through the door. Like he could be gone for five minutes. Celebrate. That's what we're doing right there. He could be gone for five minutes. Not even. And she will just go bananas as soon as he walks in the door. Just absolutely bananas. I'm like, what is the matter with you? Oh my goodness gracious me. All right, so we're going to celebrate and we're going to put a flower. All right. Um, let's see. Let's put you guys back over there. 
and we're gonna darken you guys up a little bit. I don't need the glue stick. I hit my glue gun. Let's see if I can't turn my nails brown the day I get them done. <laughs> so I actually had to go and get my nails done early. I normally wait about three weeks. It's only been about a week and a half, um, but I did have to go and get them done early uh, because I bruised one of my fingernails um, the last time I went to get my nails done. Um, they had done them really bad and I wasn't really aware of just how bad they were until I went to a different nail salon and they were like, yeah, they should have done it, you know, X, Y, and Z. I was like, oh, okay, well, whatever. Anyway, so I had to go back in a little bit earlier than normal to get that done. All right, so celebrate. We are going to celebrate and we're going to celebrate there we go okay oh i should have pinned that i forgot oops all right wait for this to come down to the bottom or rather the top because that is the top isn't it and it's so cute because the um, the guy that did my nails, he put snowflakes on my nails. See? Isn't that cute? He did little snowflakes. And that one. It's just adorable. Because I couldn't decide if I wanted to do Christmas or winter. Because I figured I would be able to wait a little while um, before doing my nails again. So I figured I was talking to a friend of mine. And we both decided, you know, winter is probably the best option. Because I think by the time I get my nails done again, Christmas is going to be over. And past. All right, so that's it. So like I said, today when you guys see this will be the fourth. Okay, so I am going to go ahead and do the third and the fourth. And I'm going to do a couple more. And then I'm going to leave a few so we can do together. And we're going to do this. We're going to work on the December daily on Fridays. Okay. So next month we'll come up with something different. But for now, for the month of December, Fridays, so the 4th, 11th, 18th, and 25th, we're going to be doing an inspirational quote of the day for our December daily. Sounds like fun, right? So if you guys love this idea and you want me to feature your favorite quote, make sure that you email me. My, my email is in the description box and I need to have the source of the quote. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you so much for joining me. And I really hope that these quotes inspire you and uplift you. And I just can't wait to do more. So thank you guys so much for sharing this with me and I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.